Okay, so obviously there's some big differences between German and American rap. I've been reacting to German and American music for a while now, and I can probably point out like some differences that I've noticed with both genres of music. Okay, so I'm gonna play you guys two different tracks, and you guys tell me what you guys hear as far as differences go. They're kind of similar as far as what I picked, but you guys decide um, how these things, these two different examples sound. Vor Lachen nicht ins Schlaf, ha! Ich komm und zeig Präsenz, breit greifen beim Labenz. Kick aufs Pedal mit brandneuen Nike TNs. Zeig das Geld mit paar hundert Gramm, die Runden fahren. Denn der Kundenstamm ruft alle zehn Sekunden an. Now here's the American song. Now what you notice between the two that I actually enjoy with both of them is they both have super dope beats and the flows for each song and stuff are like, they're both really catchy. And what I've noticed a lot about Germany's uh, music is that they're very like they, they focus a lot a lot more I feel like on their their audio like their bass and stuff like that like their beats like their the producers are amazing uh, definitely like you know second to none um, American producers are also very good as well like we come up with new revolutionary things all the time so I think between Germany and the US there's a lot of similarities obviously there's a big difference as well you have like you know I feel like German rap to an extent sounds more aggressive in its own right and then American rap sounds just as aggressive in its own right, but in a different way, if that makes sense. So you kind of blend the two together and it's like a super crazy cluster of music and whatnot. So for the people who've been following me since last year, I discovered groups like 187 Strausenbahn that, you know, has Jesus, LX, Maxwell, uh, Sapphire, a uh, whole bunch of people, uh, Bones MC, all of them are like all in the cut in this big group, right? And then you have groups uh, in the rap industry like GBE, you have, you know, the No Limit crew. I mean, those are like, you know, Chicago rappers and stuff, but you have like different squads and everything and a whole bunch of stuff in like the American rap community. You kind of blend those all together and you have a really nice blend of authentic, raw drill slash trap music it's amazing what really draws me into it what drew me into the german scene when i initially started reacting to german rap was the strong similarity in producers like the style of the music that's produced i'm gonna play you guys another clip <laughs> now this to me was super similar to a lot of stuff i've heard in you know america and like music and whatnot and i'm like wow dude like i don't even have to understand it to like feel how lit this is this is crazy so i figured hey man like might as well you know appreciate it and stuff like that and keep listening to it because it's it's pretty dope and i know like american music is absolutely amazing as well there's a lot a lot a lot of pretty, pretty dope stuff i know you a lot of you guys send me songs that sound a little similar to each other and whatnot i'm gonna be doing another video on that but i wanted to make a really quick video on some things i've noticed with german rap and american rap and uh how they're kind of like you know similar and whatnot to me and yeah that's pretty much it thank you guys for watching like comment subscribe turn on your post notifications this is an extremely short video sorry for the lack of uh yeah <laughs> take care peace